Hello everyone, this is Duck 2, welcome to another mod overview, this time on Vacuum Chest. A mod that simply adds in a vacuum chest, and obviously is inspired or trying to mimic the, uh, or probably do exactly the same as the Ender.io vacuum chest. And there's a lot of these types of mods where I've seen even one for actually additions phantom faces as well, so there's a lot of these types of smaller ones that are quite cool to use. So. Uh, similar to, I guess, the open blocks elevator as well. It's that category. So, vacuum chest. Simply made with netherite, eye of ender, ender chest, and glass panes. Now, obviously, as it says in the name, it's a vacuum chest. So, it can obviously pick up any types of items in a certain range. I don't know how much. I'll just put, say, a bunch of different sand or something in the area and see how it goes. Nothing happening there. Uh, range is nothing at the moment, so if we need paper. paper for filters, so you just put one in there, if you can put a stack in I guess. Uh, so we'll do this, we'll do sand, it's not a ghost version, there's nothing there, if I just do on top of it, or in range of it, it's not going to pick it up, can you get on top, thanks, that'd be great. There's nothing there, I don't know how you increase the Range yet. Ender pearls, there we go. So I just had to read that part. Whoops. Now we'll do this. Nothing there. What does that mean? That's that now. Don't think you need redstone either. Is that going to just pick it up? Do I have to put something in there either? Okay. Let's try this. Nothing. Possibility of an item filter. Such and such range. That. Okay, am I missing something? Mr. Creator of it. Um, nope, there's that. Okay. What have you got for us? Spawn eggs. What am I missing here? So it's easily picking them up. Obviously the 3x3 three three is the default range. I don't think I have another mod conflicting in with it. Interesting, so that's that. There's nothing in the filter preventing it. Actually. Do without that. Okay, so now that's working. So it immediately picks it up. Interesting. Okay. So immediately before it even gets into hits the ground, it's immediately being picked up. So it's because I had the filter for some reason. Is that for blacklisting, then? Interesting. I'll try... Whoa. Yeah, so that's for blacklisting, it seems, and I assume you can't reverse that, either. Alright. So that's the only thing I think I was missing. The rest is probably self-explanatory. It is blast resistant as well, and that is that. Ooh. Um, as well as probably fire resistant. And I assume you don't need redstone either, you just throw stuff, and it'll pick it up. So no need for redstone at all, you just put stuff out in the world, and it'll pick it up. Obviously useful for mob drops, from farms, and certain other things, of course, within the vacuum chest's range. Um, say for maybe a quarry or something that can, um, uh, that maybe mines stuff in a particular way, drops it, or you get a bunch of TNT exploding things in the area, got that as well. Thing because I don't need it currently. Background. Thanks so much for watching and goodbye. Uh, actually, what do you need to break it? That's one thing you probably should test. Is do you need a netherite pickaxe to break this? Now I can just place it one down if I need to. Um, can you break it down with a wooden pick? Yes, you can. Okay, so you don't need anything out of. Can I break it with my fist, actually? So I'm going to go with a piston. Possibly? You can. Okay, cool. So you don't need to. Cool. That's fine. Thanks so much for watching, and goodbye.